Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Today, we are late. We are running late. The girls are out there getting the horses done because I had to pack up his lunch and get everything ready. Oh, in the house. We literally need to be on the road in five minutes. Nobody's had breakfast. Nobody, like, the girls aren't even at the barn, at the house yet. I'm going to run out there and uh, do the chickens. I'm going to give them my last coveted cherry tomatoes. I love these so much, you guys. I'm going to share them with my chickens. They fight over me now. Look. They're like, come on! She's here! And let me tell you, it's not because of the food I bring. Okay, it's because of the food I bring. <laughs> They're like, yay! They get breakfast. <laughs> They're afraid to go past me. Do they like your tomatoes? There's another. That's a big one. <laughs> that one's carrying it. They love red. You can see red. Oh, and there's already an egg in there, and I'm gonna give one to my big girl, just in case she wants it. My egg-laying girl. Okay, they love it. They love their treat. And they're sharing. We have sharing chickens. <laughs> Do you like it? The red ones just want it all for themselves. There's more. Go look around. Okay, can't waste any more time. One thing I hate about fall, and the way you know it's fall, it's a bit cool in the morning. But the ground is still completely soaked with dew. So when you're walking through the grass, you get soaked and it's cold. Not my favorite feeling. Can you guys see it? All the dew. Like there, the ground is soaked. Girls, girls still not coming up. Horses are out there. Every time we go someplace, Sam loses the keys. Every time. Which is why if he had a bra, he would never lose his keys again. But I mean, he's got pockets. Got pockets, you think you put them in there? I got pockets too. Today is the very last day of camp 2020. Last day of camp 2020. Last night's lesson was so fun. Yeah, so so his bucking is so smooth. Yeah, Sophie had an amazing time in her bucking lesson yesterday. You guys saw it already. Thank you for all the love. Yeah, like you guys were so kind. Imagine coming home and racing home and telling your mom, like, I did this, and your mom being so excited for you. And then imagine 500 moms, because that's like how many people have already left comments. Imagine 500 moms being like, yes, Sophie, you did it. Like, it's such a good feeling. It's amazing. It's amazing. All right, so uh, Gabby, what color are you wearing today? Blue, because I'm probably going to be on Denver because Fiona hinted to it yesterday. Yeah, she thinks that Denver is the boy today, so it'll be exciting to see. And I'm going to get... Denver's fun to ride, but you have to turn early because he's like a big bus. Did you bring your dumb muffin? Um, oh no. You got to go get your muffin. There is no going to camp without breakfast, let me tell you that. Like, that's not going to oh, happen. You can't ride. So Gabby has to go. <laughs> She's running. Whoosh! She's got the blue, she's got the blue saddle pad. She's got her saddle. I wonder if her saddle will fit Denver. Denver's a big horse. Storm and Finn are big horses too, so we'll see. Finn's not a big horse. No, but he's wide and hefty. But anyways, you guys, I, uh, I'm gonna take this few minutes to tell you guys that I think I found the horse. Like, I think I found my horse. I think, I told you guys before that I am going to oh, let this so. horse find me. I'm gonna let my dream horse find me. And last night, just there by myself minding my own business and then a horse just jumped at me like suddenly I was what in one, Chino or Finn? yeah no not our horses okay give me the keys please thank you so basically I have a really strong feeling about this horse like I always feel nervous when we're buying a new horse and she lives a bit far away but I think she's the one like she's the breed she's the size she's the age she's the girl How she's, old is she? she's the same age as Sophie so she just turned 11 hmm. so she's not the same age as me you're turning 11 you're born in the same year so yeah I think I found her I think I found her I don't want to share too much I am gonna pursue it we still need to get some videos um, before we go to, to try her and to see her but I almost feel like you know how after something happens you can look back and be like oh I could see how that was meant to happen like you could just see the total trail of how it was gonna happen once you've done that a few times you can learn to look back before you go back 
looking at all the signs right now, I can see that I think maybe she's the one. I think she's the horse that God is sending me. Right time, wrong time, I feel like. I feel like this is my girl. Like, I think maybe. It's such a weird feeling to look at a horse and think she might be meant for you, but not know her and not love her yet. Like, yeah, I don't know you guys. I'll keep you posted. All right, you guys, this is Hope. You guys know Hope? She's been on her channel lots of times. She's riding my horse. Hope you're being good to my horse. Oh, I love him. This is Denver. I have a thing for Palominos. Yeah, and there is that horse. No. Sophie really likes riding her. That's Polly. So this is what it looks like at camp when under quarantine. They aren't allowed to go anywhere or touch anything. They leave their lunches there. They wear masks in the barn. I think he's 16 too or something. 16.3, so he's as big as Chino. He did, I don't remember him being this big when I rode him. I like to ride a short, fat horse, or at least a wide horse. I like a couch. He's like, hi, what's the matter, dude? Are you okay? He's got hay in his mouth. He'd make a good match for Gracie. For anybody who's new to our channel, this is where we bought Gracie from. She was at this barn. All right, so this is Tori. You guys have known Tori. She's been on our channel. She's the best jumper of the group best jumper on foot I mean she could be the best jumper too I don't know but look at this horse they all just want to put their heads in the corner they're all like oh no She's not again nap. she made us walk really far the just, end of the did she run from you did she run from you no oh that's she, good she doesn't have enough energy to trot <laughs> yeah. well Tori's gonna get her energetic today hopefully well, those just hopes, though is a hoof. Put your, put your hand by it. Right. So we got Rachel in three. Rachel from Ray's Riding. Do you ride in this? Pardon? Do you ride? Yeah. Oh, that's good. So Kaylee rides too? Uh, Kaylee does run the camp. I'm not in the camp this time. Oh, you're in the camp. You're not a counselor. Oh, that's super cool. All right, here's Coco. Who's behind door number four? four. Who do you think it is? Riding beautiful Coco. Shayla, you can't tell because she's got a mask on and a hat and she's all dressed in black. Shayla has changed, you guys. She's all cloak and dagger now. That's her. <laughs> so Coco and I were cantering over by the purple oxer and he tripped and fell on his face and I fell forward instead of getting launched forward. I fell in front of him and as he was getting up, he kicked me in the face. Kicked her in the face yesterday. So she's got a big swollen nose. Did it bleed, Shayla? Like crazy. Like crazy. Fiona said it was like a faucet. So she's I all... I tried to get up and get him, but Fiona wouldn't let him. Yeah, when you, you yeah, when you get a head injury or a face yeah. injury, you kind of wait it out. So she has war wounds under that mask. Would there be a video on your channel? Shayla Equestrian? I got it. I got some of the footage like right after when I was putting him away, how swollen it was. Yeah, she's still pretty swollen under there. All right, so if you guys want to see about Shayla's injury, check out her channel. Shayla Equestrian, and she's riding Sparky, nope, Coco. Coco, back on the horse, that's what you gotta do. And then we have Gabby in number five, Hope in number six, Hope in Denver, and Tori in number seven, lucky number seven. I like the little stations, I think it's really, really nice, like, so? yeah, like the whole, all the stations and stuff, like it's really neat. It's a lot more organized than everybody walking past the yeah, it's really nice too. Can you move your horse over? Oh my god, your horse kicks. Can you push it over further? Yeah. <laughs> she won't move her horse over. Her horse bit mine. Or if somebody's at the back and wants to get out, Yeah. Yeah, it's, gore it's nice. All right, this is Gabby. Rings over the head. Then we put this on their head where their ears go. The brow band has to sit up by their brows. Make sure we tuck the nose band in. You're not putting the bit in her mouth. Don't know. I me. dare you. Put the bit in her mouth, all and the little kids. The other parts, but Gabby has to go rock. Thank all you. the little kids. Kaylee's teaching all the little kids. I can't show you, but there's like a bunch of little kids. And they're like, put the broody bit in Gabby's mouth. <laughs> you want to see her put the bit in her mouth? Yeah. Seven, <laughs> Seven little kids. Put the bit in your mouth, bit. Gabby. Like, I'm warning you, it looks old and disgusting. <laughs> When you are a horse lover, you don't care. Yeah. <laughs> it's like metal. <laughs> you made horse camp, Gabby. They're all gonna go home. A girl put a bit in her mouth. <laughs> Do you guys wanna try? 
No! <laughs> Laura! <laughs> they all get coronavirus was, the next day. <laughs> I was joking. Do you miss her? Yeah. Yeah. Can we buy her? No. Oh. And for any of the people who think we're actually going to buy a Project Pony, we're not buying a Project we Pony. We are buying him. No, I was just like just thinking out loud. Like imagine we when bought we a... a new farm, we're buying him. We're definitely not because... We definitely are. No. You're not getting a horse. I him. am getting a horse. Apparently Gabby forgot her craft here yesterday and it was all wrapped up. Fiona gave it to me to put in the car and... I just looked at it on my way to the car. She probably wouldn't want me to show you guys, so I'm gonna show you guys. <laughs> I'm gonna show you anyway. Girls are like so super paranoid about their their crafts. Anyways, I wanna show you guys what she did. So they made mugs and I wanna show you, like my heart just was so happy when I saw it. So it's this mug and it's his storm with his marking, which I love his marking, you guys. Like that, that's cool. He's got a cool marking. And then she's got like different colors around the rim. And then as you turn it, she's got all the horses names. Stello. Okay, so she's got Stormy. Look at it. And Stormy, for all you girls out there who think that Stormy is not her heart horse, everything that she's done at camp this, this year has been about Stormy. So Stormy is the main big picture. And then she's got Stella and Chino and Gracie and Willow and Finn. Poor little Finn's just a little tiny afterthought in the corner. But like... That proves it, you guys. She also made this coaster the other day. Like, that marking again. Like, the girl loves her boy. Can you never saw it? Don't tell her. So today, yeah, Sophie and I are staying at camp in the morning because um, they're not having a show. So we're allowed to stay and watch their ride on the last day. And in the arena with all like the open doors and stuff, you don't have to wear a mask. So that's why we're here. We're gonna uh, watch Gabby ride. I'm gonna video and it's gonna go on her channel. She's doing like a little video about her horse camp this year, 2020, which is just such a weird camp year. So if you guys wanna watch it, Gabby's channel is Always Gabby on YouTube, just Always Gabby. Sophie, are you feeling sad you didn't go to camp to hang out with everybody? Yeah. yeah. Next year? Yeah. yeah. Bring your own boy. Bring your own horse. She's like, I don't like to bring my own horse because I don't like to leave him here. Meet Kaylee, the new horse. I could call this, meet my new horse. This is our new horse, Kaylee. <laughs> this is what I do to get my volunteer hours to graduate high school. Yeah, we have to have volunteer hours and she's volunteering to help these beautiful little girls. They're all beautiful. All right. Hello. Yeah. Yeah. Just for the just for you the ride. You can hear Kaylee's teaching skills. Child, stop over here now. <laughs> That's Gabby's teaching skills. All right. Here we go. Did you wash your saddle after the rain yesterday? No. Uh oh. Got to do that when we get home. It wasn't rained on hard. Flash to how hard it was raining yesterday. Like you, you're like it was bad. Gabby, are you jumping the canoe? Have you? What jump did you fall over, Shayla? Oh, she didn't fall over a jump. She fell in that corner. Scary corner. There's Hope. Hope coming in with my boy. I love that horse. Hope says that he's not been jumping very well. They all look super energetic out there. Just walking slower than slow. I don't know who's... Yeah, I was going to just say that. I don't know who's more energetic, the horses or the kids. Polly is going to enjoy Thursday, Friday. Yeah, Polly. Like, they all just stuck their heads in the corner of the stalls and were like, oh no. Oh yeah. Polly if if Polly could kick the crap in a red neck right now, she would. She <laughs> wouldn't have to work. If they were sound. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Enjoying life. Enjoying life. Yeah. But they are not sound and therefore she is. Yeah. I'm pretty sure Storm has a new appreciation for Chino now, too. Yes. <laughs> Look at all these girls. Half these girls have YouTube channels. Rachel and Shayla. Where's your YouTube channel? Do you have one? Um, did you do that bridle up? Oh, I can see the problem. You and Kaylee need a lesson. <laughs> Kaylee, Kaylee's teaching all the kids about... <laughs> yep, okay, this is it. It's a good learning experience. All right, all the little kids. What's wrong with it? What's wrong with Polly's brother? One little kid comes right no up way, to the front. No way, I know what it is. <laughs> no. Guys, go figure out. Got their feet. You're going to need to get off. Yeah, I 
Don't tell them, Look but go ahead and get off and get They're off. all looking. <laughs> They're like, Look at boys. What, what is the message? Too tight. That's what I like. No, no. What do we do first after we put the reins on our bridles on? Watch what she does. She forgot to do. Yeah. Oh, it goes inside. It goes inside because if it stays on the outside, she won't be able to steer. I can see challenges on her. Rachel made a move. Hope got on her yesterday. She didn't even have an option to go slow, and it was wicked. Let her warm up before you ask her to put her nose down, please. All right, Tori, it's up to you to make me see that horse move. There we go. You got it easy yesterday. She is. Now you got to work today. She is a pretty horse, though. You know what? And when she goes, she's actually like. They were riding jumps and she wasn't like something on the other side of the wow. road. Actually lifting up. Moving. That's Tori's amazing. Tori's gonna make her move today, right? Yeah. Tori's like, well wait, I'm not moving yet. I need my coffee. And then there is my boy. Who's Denver doing? Uh Rachel has a whip. Yeah. She didn't <laughs> oh, oh. Before I even <laughs> knew her, before I even knew her, she said to me, I was like trying to tack up a horse when I was having a lesson. And I said, does she need this or does this fit? And she goes, I don't know, turn around. Let me see how fat you are. <laughs> I'm like, by the horse. And Laura's like, what? <laughs> she just call me fat? I actually turned around so she could see how fat I was. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm like, all right, this is what horse people do. I didn't know. Yeah. Yeah. Beauty over comfort. Yeah. Gabby always has to dress. Tucked in shirt with belt. Hair tied back. Put up in your helmet preferably. Yeah, she has a hairnet. There we go. Right. Gotta pick up our feet and move. Flipped over on top. There will be no flipping over today. I There's know. nothing over there. It's right between the purple jump and the black flag. There's nothing there. It's all flat. I mean, it's been dragged how many times between you falling off and her falling off. So there's nothing. Like, there's no dip. There's no nothing. Point. I think, um, She's bouncy. Good job. Good job, Hope. I think Hercules is the most stunning pony horse. Oh, he's beautiful, though. Canter. Parking anyway. We're not. I guess so. Yeah. I love Hold him. Down. Yay, Coco's trotting. Love it. Gidget. This is Brandon's horse and she's cute. I feel the love for her too. Like, you know, like sometimes you just want to buy some horses. Like, I would buy her. She's a warm blood. And she's so friendly. She's a devil in the field, though. Are you a devil in the field? I mean, not for me. You know, one day we might have, like, a better farm and 100 horses. No, not 100 horses, but we might have more horses, you guys. 
I'm not gonna promise that I won't buy another horse. I won't look at her. She's like, touch me. Yeah, oh gosh. She's like, <laughs> I love you. Yes, I do. Don't bite me. Don't. Jeez, what are you trying to do? Eat me? She's like, I'll come home with you. Yeah, you're a good girl. All right, we're going home. I'm going home. Good job, Gabby, you did amazing. I like her, she's a nice horse, eh? Look, she has less of a, well, actually, I guess she still has more than Storm. Yeah, you look good with her in blue. I like her in blue. All right. Oh, I love her in blue. All right, I'm leaving, I'm going home. I'll see you at 3.30 or 2.30. Yeah, all right, so I'm leaving and Sophie's fallen in love with what? Five-year-old. Being the counselor, she wants to stay so and help. every time I don't go to camp, um, I'm being counselor. So you need to get hours to graduate high school. You have to volunteer. So you can volunteer, I told Fiona that you're ready and you love it, so she's gonna stay and help Kaylee, right? She's so excited. I um, already, they were probably funny. <laughs> Were you laughing? Yeah. This is such a cute little farm. The one thing that I want for our new farm is I want no road. I want a quiet, quiet, amazing farm like that. Like I don't care what the house looks like. I just want good fencing and an indoor and a nice barn and oh. no road. I don't want any highway. I just want like a nice, quiet, I love being in the quiet country. Anyway, yeah, I'm going home. I got no kids to come with me. Like, that's nuts. By myself, I'm gonna have like a couple hours by myself. What should I do? I should go out there and ride all the horses. Thumbs up this video if you think I should ride all the horses when I get home. My heart is in the box. Oh, look. I didn't turn on the light, you guys, but every day. <laughs> Same place. Super cuties. I love them. Believe it or not, I was against getting the kittens. It was all Sam. All Sam's idea. Do not wreck our stuff, ponies. Ruby, Molly loves a good whip. Um, I am going to, okay. So, whoops. I wasn't, I didn't come down this morning to do chores. I don't know if the horses had water in the field. I know Sam would've given them fresh water when he put them in last night. I know, you guys want supper. I'll be back. I'll be back to give you some lunch. It's early days, it's early. Here, I was gonna give, well, I'm gonna give these to the boys. I'll be back. I have a, no, I have a pair. I'll be back. Uh-oh, what is that about? This girl never does that. This is concerning. Uh-oh. What's the matter, Greasy? Oh, dear. I've been feeling so good today. Don't be scaring me. What's the matter? Oh, gosh. Don't you know that you're beautiful?